best hearing aids in 2020. Um, there's two main, of course there's many different manufacturers, so you're always needing to compare apples to apples. So the top two that I would say, so kind of the runner up here would be the Phonak Marble. So it has Bluetooth capability, um, it has rechargeability, which is nice, um, streaming, and then you have an app that you can adjust with volume control. And I would say the winner above that would be um, Resound Quattro. So what I like, the differences between the two, the charger with the Quattro, you have a charger that keeps a charge. So, you know, it's fully charged, you're going on a weekend trip, unplug it from the wall, take it with you, you still get at least three more charges out of it before you have to plug it back into the wall. Whereas the Marvel has to stay plugged into a wall to, to gain that charge. Also, the app between the two um, is also a little bit different. With, the Re with Resound Quattro, you have more that you can do with it. And what I mean by that is, say you're in an environment that you feel needs a little bit more filtering for the environment. It says noise filter, you click on it, hearing aids automatically adjust for that. Whereas with Phonak, it doesn't have that capability of doing that. Both have what's called a remote assist feature. So you can be out of town and request assistance. Um, asking for example would be, you know, I think I feel like I need a little bit more clarity. I can remotely make that change here. Um, it sends it through the cloud via the phone and through the app and you can install those settings to, to the hearing aids. Both have what's called a live assistance feature which it's almost like a FaceTime so we can see each other and you can show me what's going on and I can help. Um, also the Bluetooth capability is a little bit different. I like it and patients have also said they like it better in the Quattro. Um, so the Quattro uses a low frequency as far as the connectivity for pairing. So when you're streaming a lot like media or phone calls, the device that it's connected to doesn't get hot over time. Whereas with the Marvel, it's just straight Bluetooth and usually has that interaction um, with the device getting a little bit heated over time. And then also the sound of the streaming is also different. I've had patients with the Marvel say, you know, the person on the other end has, you know, kind of cuts in and out, it's just not really clear. Whereas the streaming through the Quattro, it's been a pretty good um, signal between the two. So as far as the top two, that would um, be the big difference. Of course, the sound's a little bit different between two. They both have different software and the programming. So overall, I would definitely say the top would be the Resound Quattro.